Welcome to this shithead's vlog. That's life of Luke. <laughs> I don't know how to do these things. Hey guys, my name's Luke. I'm a big YouTube star now, so I do a vlog channel so you can see what's going on in my life. Here I am at the beach. See, look, there's a beach over there. So I went to Geelong and now we're in Torquay with Emily. We went in a helicopter today. Cut to that montage. Yeah. Cash money, heroes. Private jets, polish. That was a sick montage, wasn't it? Now what are we doing? We're staying in some weird cottage. I'll do a cottage tour when we go back. It's, it's a 1903 cottage. Yeah. It's it's so cool. the Wi-Fi doesn't work because there was it's no cool. Wi-Fi in 1903. <laughs> Not really. The bed is haunted. <laughs> Hi, my name's Luke and welcome to my crib. Here's the haunted bed I was telling you about earlier. Creeps me out. We go into the, uh, the bathroom. Spa, so that just makes it harder to shower. That looks like it's gonna pump out gas, not water. So we've got the old Auschwitz shower there, so we'll close that off. Pretty much half the things in this apartment aren't from 1903. It's supposed to be like an old cottage. Like that, I don't think they had that in 1903. That's probably the guy who made the bed. He's like, <laughs> he's checking for spirits in his glass. Yeah. The both kind, what? alcoholic and the, and the demonic. <laughs> this is our vintage 1903 te television. That actually is vintage. This is like vintage 07. <laughs> what is that? Have you ever heard of the brand called Grumdig? <laughs> So shit. That concludes the cottage tour. Um, it's quite small, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And that was my crib. I don't own it, but this is my current crib. I should own it. Well, you should say it was your crib from the start. <laughs> that was not that funny. She gave me too much. Oh yeah, a few people have been asking on Snapchat, how come you're dating me? Like mm. everyone thinks you're way too good for me. I thought he had money. She was so very wrong. <laughs> I literally bought bought us a cottage from 115 years ago. Oh wait, 114. See, I'm shit at maths too. Hey Lewis, check out my vlog camera. Cause it's a phone and I'm poor as fuck. <laughs> you are. We're filming, we're doing a photo shoot today. Yeah, for Luke. Photo. You're filming, but then we're doing a photo later. That's why we're here. Just get it right mate. Don't zoom. It doesn't zoom enough to meme you on an iPhone. So shit, I'm too poor to meme you. <laughs> <laughs> First photo shoot we've ever done. It is, isn't it? It's I feel amazing. uncomfortable. <laughs> Professional comedian. It's his job. <laughs> So, if you didn't know, for the last three months, I've been doing a national radio show with Lewis Spears. Radio boy. Hamish and Andy's studio. Yo. Oh, he smells like Andy. <laughs> <laughs> We're on every single weekday on Triple M Modern Digital, and we've done some good shit that I'm really proud of. Uh, I walked to work for 30 kilometers. Uh, it took me five and a half hours just to prove that I don't live in the country. I walk to work. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> no, yes, I will. Uh, we've also had some awesome guests on our show, like Hamish Blake and Reese Maston came on, played the last performance of Good Night. Not Hamish, Reese did that. And we also briefly interviewed Rita Ora in the corridor as she was trying to leave the building. Um, ruined her day. <laughs> what else did we do? We did a show in an elevator. I had to wear a donut costume while I was racing Lewis in a running race. I lost a game of Diet Ginger Beer Pong, which meant I had to get a spray tan for schoolies week. It's like spray tanning a really ugly pale canvas. <laughs> this is great. How do you feel? I feel like I should have gone to university. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, if you want to check that out, go check out the radio show below. I just thought I should recap it in case a few of you were like, where all the videos been for the last three months? That's what I've been doing. So, um, to end this episode, I found a really weird moment from my Sydney stand-up show earlier in the year. There was this really drunk woman in the crowd, like, quite older than my usual demographic, like mid-30s, and she was super drunk, had way too many wines, so I started talking to her because she was heckling uh, for ages before this clip starts. And yeah, here's how that interaction went. It got fucking weird. Enjoy. So you're like, not really my target demographic. Oh my god, I'm 
I'm so glad you pointed that out. Because <laughs> yeah. we've like noticed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, so oh did God. you know we're like videos? so parents and we're so old. No, and it's yet great. we love you and we're the only ones that are parents. Oh, do you so like my shit online? Absolutely. Like we're like <laughs> you're like number one. That's awesome. And we share it and no one else comments. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got I had four hundred friends, I now have six. six. <laughs> oh, yeah, One, two, three. Like, <laughs> 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 A few moments later. No good friends. Delete, delete, delete. I now have six. You have six mates? On Facebook. But I many, had 400. But how many mates do you actually have? I don't know. Probably <laughs> two, no. I think you've lost two. <laughs> I still didn't get any engagement. Oh, she did too. Any interactive engagement, but nothing. Oh, but thank you for trying to share my shit to your six mates, actually. I shared it to 400, but no one did. That's <laughs> fucking weird. Oh wait, so that's why you unfriended them? Yeah. They didn't get around my shit. Because they didn't interact and I called them out on it. And Dude, they I see my shit no one gets around it. I don't know. It's so funny. He even said he's not funny. I posted the bit where you said you're not even funny. He admits he's not funny. Where and they killed him. That? <laughs> this is fucking hilarious. <laughs> Which video did you share? <laughs> I shared your, the various recent videos. So you shared videos lots of recent videos. Of like, you see, you don't so know when you shared them, you had 400 friends, <laughs> and no one liked them, so you were like, fuck these people. <laughs> <laughs> this shit is hilarious. I normally get them. So I'm the reason added. why you have no mates. <laughs> Because then I went further. I went, oh look, he's even admitting he's actually sex. He's actually an intelligent guy. I think he's seen a bad review. Then the comment is a One eternity later. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I was like, I bet going to be fun. <laughs> 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 oh. I have to. Oh, okay, so, um, <laughs> I found there's a few massive problems in the world. 